this guy's gonna be so good. And he's like, been, like when he's gotten so he has gotten so good. Yeah. He's been playing out of his mind this tournament. Like I remember when Sir Spud showed up to our first local because he came around the time I was leaving. Oh, and Tosi's Tosi's Tos Tos doing septile, which is very interesting. So yeah, so this is interesting, real quick to me because uh, I was talking to Sir Spud earlier. He was telling me he thinks Lucario is Gengar's worst matchup. Period. Lucario is Gengar's worst matchup. But I have also heard, you know, I, I haven't talked to Sir Spud about Sceptile, but I've heard Gengar say that uh, they actually do very well against Sceptile. So I'm definitely interested oh. into, as to why uh, Toasty is opting for the Sceptile in this matchup. Maybe he doesn't, maybe he wants to fill him out first. Because Toast, that is a very Toasty thing to do. Toasty, like I said, he's a. He's a I've never player, seen this Sceptile He's tournament. a player who likes to fill people out, he's a player who likes to um, get some knowledge before he goes in, you know? Right. He's not gonna just instantly RPS you to death. He's going yeah. to he's going to see your habits and then make educated guesses based on those habits. Ooh, so what what this play. is? I I don't play Gengar or Sceptile, but I do know both toolkits and kind of what they want to do. At mid range, I could see Gengar struggling like he is right now. Yeah, Sceptile is all about that mid range. All Absolutely. about the mid range. All about the baiting. All about the waiting. And oh, gonna get I, a punish on that leaf blade though. That's very good. And. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Sir Spud just makes me so happy watching him. Gengar, good Gengar in general makes me very happy to watch. I just, it's just, it's a... Oh, he was blocking. Oh, nice. And there, react yeah. to that Giga Drain, and You gotta react to the Giga kill. Drain, that yeah. is the round. So, I would imagine that this is hard for Gengar to approach. Right, yeah, again, but that once, mid range game But once Gengar difficult. gets in, he yeah. kind of does like his own thing because you know the Scooby, it's mm -hmm. true mid. You're plus. You're JY. You're plus. You know. Yeah, and Septile not having yeah. a nine frame. Not. He's got you know Leaf Blade. He's got um, uh, detect. But other than that, not really the greatest you know up close so options. See, what what I would like to see Spud do right now is I want to see him lay down some more sludge bombs. I want to see him um, zone a little bit like he is right now, and I want to see him make Toasty approach him. Yeah, Because I feel like if Gengar has to make, or if Sceptile, I'm sorry, if Sceptile um, has to approach, he's at a little bit of a disadvantage, and Gengar can kind of sit there and do what he wants to do, you know? Right. But he, I see Sorcerer getting a little antsy. He's jumping when he doesn't really need to jump, and he just needs to, like, you know, either take the grab or just, you know, block and chill. That was a really nice trap right there from Posty. It was very good. Able to get that phase shift. All right. Okay. So it's about getting out of the corner a little okay. bit. Okay, that oh, was very smart. He did the curse to get his burst. That yep. was beautiful. So now he gets the <gasps> Eevee, but he's gonna get Leaf Blade. Ooh, no Giga Drain after. No Leaf Giga Blade, Drain though. after Leaf Blade. He that would have won the chance. game. That would have won the game right there for Toasty. Now he's got to deal with a burst mode, Rage, Eevee boosted, Gengar. Can he burst and... that? No. no. Uh, actually, you don't think much. Oh gosh, to. the counter attack catching. What's it gonna be? Oh, oh looking oh, for nice. a tick throw. That was nice, but Toasty was aware and he did his J Axe. So that was really good. Smart stuff from Toasty, not falling for that trick. And he's going to take game one with the Sceptile. I definitely was not expecting this at all, but good stuff. I can see, I, I can, I can see kind of why, because because Sceptile as a character, he kind of forces you to like sit back, mm -hmm. kind of like chill, you know, see what they're going to do. Except for thanks Sola, he doesn't play like that. <laughs> he just kind of... He does his own thing. He just kind of... But he, does it but, he, but he does it well. He does it well. Oh, yeah. You Absolutely. guys know what I'm talking about. You guys know. <laughs> okay, so, but... So we might see a support. Nope, we are not going to no. see a support. I think, I think he's just taking his time, just wants to see what what he could have done better. And like, again, I said, what what Sir Spud, in my opinion, needs to do, he needs to win feel phase. Oh, absolutely. He, need, he, he needs, needs that to, meter. And he needs to zone. He needs to make Sceptile come to him. Because Sceptile can just play that mid-range game all day and just be at advantage yeah. and just not care. He's really not threatened by anything Gengar has other than maybe the Astonish at mid-range. Maybe. All right, good reaction. Oh, the not, permeate not working out. Yeah, that lingers. That 8Y lingers forever. That Another 8Y one. is ling And you know what? I can see why he would pick Sceptile now because that 8Y is just lingering so well. So every time Sir Spud tries to approach and permeate, that was a great. Has, never oh, been, nice! That was a great dodge on him all day. But actually. see, look at that. Every time Sir Spud tries to jump in, yeah, he's still getting. He's gonna by get blown wise. up, and I don't know what Sir Spud could really do. I'm wondering why Gengar say this is a good matchup for them because Toasty is really showing otherwise right now. But here we're seeing uh, Sir Spud starting up with the zoning, like you said, he should. Oh, getting hit, getting hit by the flash kick. 
I just want to see Spud Zone just a little bit. Make him jump over, you know, get close, see what you can do. Oh, that's a punish. There Very we go. Nice. Okay, so, so oh, yeah, that's gonna be some I, meter. the grab is really good to get because, as you mm -hmm. know, Gengar burst is just oh, absolutely ridiculous. And yeah. those grabs will help him build burst. He's going oh, to get punished because the ghost types dashes are a little slower. They have right. more iframes, but they are more punishable. Great leaf he's going to get leaf played. So, Spud, he's this is this he's is, on his last is, leg. This yeah, this is this is match point. This for, is make or break for Sir Spud right yeah. now. He's got to take this round. He's got to take this game to stay alive. I want to see Spud not jump in so much. Jumping in is not right. working for him. Yeah, he's getting. He in does here have burst very often, very consistently. He's got wait wow he does have a burst. Shout yes. out to whimsical. Oh my god. <laughs> And he's gonna Here go, go right he's just for gonna it. Pop it like, bruh. <laughs> okay. Nice. The get the knockdown. knockdown. Get, get the knockdown. Him. Get plus. Get in his face. Make Toasty feel the pressure. That's what you want. Oh, here you he want comes. him to feel like he has to do something. Oh, first that. Nice. Oh, he got is it. Is that a punish? That is definitely no, I mean, not a punish. It, but he's he gonna get that. Emolga. Nice. But oh, he's gonna get hit by the Giga Drain. And that's painful. I'm really surprised that Burst Act didn't punish, to be honest. Me too, actually. He's oh, gonna get hit by his invulnerable frames from J -Y or JX, excuse me. He's gonna get the Burst Attack. Yeah, this will scale a little bit, It'll, but not much. Bit, After just one five wide, this will still do good damage for Toasty. Mm -hmm. And, wow, great damage for Toasty, actually. Also, I mean, Gengar not exactly having the most amount of health. Oh, Ooh, Good confirm right there from Toasty, getting the Leaf Blade follow-up off the Leech Seed. Okay. And that's and there, gonna there's do match it. point. He got antsy and he got hit by. I would have liked to see Spud punish um, Leaf Blade more, like kind of sit in mid range and be like, yeah, Leaf Blade me and counterattack dash yeah, cancel see, grab. See it. Yep, exactly. I would like to see Spud um, wait a little bit more, but you know what? You know, we learned Pokemon a little bit. Gengar's a very hard character to play, so.